Okay, so let me show you how to make a Fat Robin Quarter Compass. Instructions are found on page 17 of your Fat Robin 60 Degree Compass book. You will start with a big pie by following steps 1 to 23 for making a compass block. Refer to the detailed cutting chart on page 16 and use the measurement for the .3 strip for quarter and half compasses to get the strip width for .3 which I am showing in light purple for this step. This is an 18 inch quarter compass, so I have cut the .3 strip 3 and 3 quarters inches wide. These strips are thinner to cut down on waist. First, you are going to sew Big Pie onto the .3 strip as shown in step 24. Once sewn, you will press Big Pie away from the .3 strip as shown in step 26. Now you'll trim point 3 strip. Trim the strip away from the top of Big Pie by placing your ruler line on the seam and trimming the strip close to the top of Big Pie. I don't show this next part in the book, but turn the unit around and trim the other side of point 3 flush with Big Pie. Only do this for making quarter compasses as it will help when you sew on the next strip. Next, you will place a pin marker at the top of Kite B. Place Kite B down on your unit as shown in step 28, but this time you will place the pin at the top of Kite B. This will be your mark for sewing your quarter inch compass into your project so that this outside point will come out with a perfect point. Unit onto point three. Once sewn, press by laying the point three strip right side up and pressing the piece unit away from the strip. Now you will once again place a pin marker at the top of kite B, only this time you will have to turn your fat robin ruler over and use the reverse side to line it up for placing a pin at the top of kite B. For the next step, it will be easier if the pins are removed, so I use a fabric marker to place small marks in place of the pins. Now you are ready to trim your unit into a quarter compass. Start by lining up the 45 degree line through the middle of point two. Then the side of your ruler should be a quarter inch from the pen marker at the top of point three. Adjust your ruler so that both of these marks line up and make your first cut. Rotate the unit and place your straight edge ruler horizontal line on the cut you just made. Line up the right side of the ruler a quarter inch from your pin marker. Make your second cut. Now you have a quarter compass unit ready to sew into your project. Make sure you use your pen markers as a guide so that your points will come out perfectly.